The Holy Rosary, with meditations on the spiritual life, from the writings and sayings of St. Padre Pio, Franciscan priest, confessor, and stigmatist, arranged according to the 20 mysteries of the Holy Rosary. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to the dead. On the third day he rose again. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. From there he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. For an increase of faith, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For an increase of hope, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For an increase of love. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The first glorious mystery, the resurrection of Jesus from the dead. The fruit of this mystery is faith. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. He is faithful, and He never allows you to be tempted beyond your strength. Hence you must be strong and cheerful in spirit, for the Lord is in the depths of your heart. He will fight along with you and for you. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. You must have boundless faith in the divine goodness, for the victory is absolutely certain. How could you think otherwise? Isn't our God more concerned about our salvation than we are ourselves? Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Renew your faith in the truths of Christian doctrine, especially at times of conflict. And renew in a most particular way your faith in the promises of eternal life, which our most sweet Jesus makes to those who fight energetically and courageously. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Place all your trust in the heart of our most sweet Jesus, who is not only mine, but your Jesus also. Renew your faith continually and never give it up, for faith never abandons anyone, much less a soul that is yearning to love God. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Faith is not to be argued over. Either you accept it with your eyes closed, admitting the inadequacy of the human mind to understand its mysteries, or you reject it. There's no middle way. The choice is up to you. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Jesus replied that his grace would be enough. He allows the same voice to be heard by all souls who want to love him with sincerity and purity of heart. How can we doubt this? Isn't our God faithful? Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Be very wary of anxiety. Often place your trust in divine providence, and be sure that heaven and earth will pass away before the Lord will fail to protect you. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. In the spiritual life it is necessary to walk in good faith without uneasiness, discouragement, or sadness. If you do good, praise and thank the Lord for it. If you happen to sin, humble yourself, propose to do better, ask for help, and carry on traveling the right path. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Have no fear at all about any future harm which could happen to you in this world, because perhaps it might not happen to you at all. But in any event, if it were to come upon you, God would give you the strength to bear it. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We must take comfort in the Lord on the sweet reflection that everything is ordered by Him with weight and measure. I am confident that providence will be generous, as is always the case. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. 
The second glorious mystery, the ascension of Jesus into heaven. The fruit of this mystery is hope. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Our Divine Master assures us that no one will take your joy from you. What testimony could be more certain than this? Pondering on all this, one cannot fail to experience great gladness. This is what leads people to face the most painful trials with a cheerful heart. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Without divine grace, could you have been victorious in all the crises and all the spiritual battles which you have had to face? Well then, open your soul more and more to divine hope, have more trust in the divine mercy which is the only refuge of the soul that is exposed to a stormy sea. I want you to have greater trust in the divine mercy. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The Lord will take care of everything and will make good that which is imperfect. Jesus is with you. He has helped you up to now. He cannot and doesn't want to abandon you. He will perfect His work. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The powerful help of the paternal love of God and the great gifts of His divine majesty will undoubtedly crown your trust and perseverance with glory. This state is always temporary. Divine consolation will come, complete and total. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. How many difficulties one encounters when doing good. Never mind. But Jesus will take everything into account, my daughter. No work done for love of Him will be left without a just reward. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We must have great hope. Let us ascend without ever tiring to the heavenly vision of the Savior. Let us step by step draw away from earthly affections. Let us strip ourselves of the old man and dress ourselves in the new man, aspiring to the happiness that awaits us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Do not anticipate the problems of this life with apprehension, but rather with a perfect hope that God, to whom you belong, will free us from them accordingly. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Calm is reserved for heaven. On earth, we must always fight amidst hope and fear, on condition, however, that hope is always stronger, always keeping in mind the omnipotence of Him who comes to our aid. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Sacred Scripture says, We know that in everything God works for good with those who love Him. And in truth, given that the Lord can and is able to obtain good even from evil, for whom will He do this, if not for those who have given themselves to Him without reservation? Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I cherish the lively hope of seeing my dreams fulfilled, because the Lord cannot place thoughts and desires in a penciled soul if He does not really intend to fulfill them, to gratify these longings which He alone has caused. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The third glorious mystery, the descent of the Holy Spirit. The fruit of this mystery is the love of God. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Joy is born of happiness at possessing what we love. Now, from the moment at which the soul knows God, it is naturally led to love Him. If the soul follows this natural impulse which is caused by the Holy Spirit, it is already loving the Supreme God. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. By loving God, the soul is certain of possessing Him. When a person loves money, honors and good health, unfortunately he does not always possess what he loves, whereas he who loves God possesses Him at once. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. He who abides in love abides in God, and God abides in him. What does this scriptural passage mean to tell us? Does it not perhaps mean that the soul devoted to God out of love belongs entirely to God? while well, God gives himself entirely to that soul? Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We have a sure sign that these people really love God when we observe their readiness to keep God's holy law. Their constant watchfulness, so that they may not fall into sin, their habitual desire to see the Heavenly Father glorified, while losing no chance to spread the kingdom of God as far as lies in their power. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I understand very well that nobody can worthily love God, but when a person does all he can himself and trusts in the divine mercy, why should Jesus reject one who is seeking him like this? Has he not commanded us to love God according to our strength? If you have given and consecrated everything to God, why fear? Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Charity is the measure by which our Lord judges all things. Charity is the queen and the mother of all virtues. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. One single act of love on the part of man, one single act of charity is so great in God's eyes that he could not repay it even with the immense gift of the entire creation. Love is the spark of God in man's soul. It is the very essence of God personified in the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. You do very well to groan and pray incessantly to the Lord, that he may increase divine love in you more and more. In the ways of divine love one can never say, enough. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. True love does not consist in receiving many consolations at the service of God but rather always having a ready will to do all God is pleased to order for our spiritual advantage and His glory. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. If you love God with all your heart, everything will be converted to good. Even if at that moment you cannot understand where this good could come from, be more than ever sure that it will come without a doubt. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, 
Forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The fourth glorious mystery, the Assumption of Mary into heaven. The fruit of this mystery is the desire for heaven. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Let us pray that he may enlighten us more and more as to the immensity of the eternal inheritance which has been reserved for us by the goodness of the Heavenly Father. The crown that is being woven for you up above is far greater than can be humanly conceived. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Great is the merit of victory, indescribable the consolation, immortal the glory, and eternal the reward. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. If it seems to you that you always desire without ever arriving at the possession of perfect love, all this means that your soul must never say it has enough. It means that we cannot and must not stop on the path to divine love and holy perfection. St. Augustine says very aptly, Our heart is not at rest till it rests in the object of its love. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Let us do good and adhere to the will of God. Let this be the star on which we rest our gaze during this navigation, because in this way we cannot but reach the heavenly port. Let us not silence our expectations of the holy eternity to which we aspire. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. In order to live happily while on pilgrimage, we must keep before our eyes the hope of arriving at our homeland, where we will stay for eternity, and in the meantime we should believe this firmly. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The great God who has taken you by the hand in order to draw you to himself will not abandon you until he has placed you in his eternal tabernacle. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I am almost tired of living, and like the deer that yearns for running streams, so does my soul yearn to be consumed by the flame of that intense love. O oh death, I do not know who can fear you, for through you life begins. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I fully understand that the soul will not enter into its eternal rest until it is lost forever in that vast ocean of goodness where it will know what God knows, love what He loves, and will only enjoy what is a joy to Him. Happy the souls whose names are written in the Book of Life. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Oh, when will that greatly desired day arrive, my dear Father, when the poor little soul will be cast adrift in the immense sea of eternal truth? All the soul's troubles will then be past, and it will no longer be able to withdraw its gaze from the infinite beauty, or refrain from taking his delight in God in a perpetual ecstasy of most tender love. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Keep your eyes fixed yonder on Him, who is your guide to the heavenly country, where He is leading you. Why worry, whether it is desert or meadow, so long as God is always with you, and you arrive at the possession of a blessed eternity. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The fifth glorious mystery, the crowning of Mary as Queen of heaven and earth. The fruit of this mystery is devotion to Mary. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. May Mary fill your heart with the flowers and fragrance of ever-fresh virtues, and place her maternal hand upon your head. Always keep close to our Heavenly Mother, because she is the sea that must be crossed in order to reach the shores of eternal splendor in the kingdom of God. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We have great reason to place all our hope in God alone and in the beautiful Virgin. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I have no adequate means by which to thank the Blessed Virgin Mary, through whose intercession I have undoubtedly received so much strength from the Lord. I do not believe this strength comes to me from the world. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, 
and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. How often have I confided to this mother the painful anxieties that troubled my heart, and how often she consoled me. In my greatest sufferings, it seems to me that I no longer have a mother on this earth, but a very compassionate one in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I wish I had a voice strong enough to invite the sinners of the whole world to love Our Lady. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. In the free time you have, once you have finished your duties of state, you should kneel down and pray the rosary. Pray the rosary before the Blessed Sacrament or before a crucifix. If the Holy Virgin has urged the rosary wherever she has appeared in her recent visions, doesn't it seem that we have a special motive for praying it? Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. A woman brought ruin, and a woman was to bring salvation. The one being tempted by a serpent stamped the mark of sin on the human race. The other was to give rise through grace, pure and immaculate. Through her grace came to mankind. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. She will be the sure guide who will direct our steps toward the Divine Son, which is Jesus Christ. He makes her radiant with divine splendor and points to her as our model of purity and sanctity. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The Immaculate Conception is the first step of our salvation. Through this singular and unique gift, Mary received a profusion of divine grace, and through her cooperation she became worthy of absorbing infinitely more. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The Son who chose her for his mother poured his wisdom into her that from the very beginning by infused knowledge she knew her God. She loved and served him in the most perfect manner, as he never until then had been loved and served on this earth. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, 
Save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious Advocate, thine eyes of mercy towards us, and after this our exile. Show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may become worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Grant we beseech thee, Almighty God, that as we meditate upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, that we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ our Lord. Saint Michael the Archangel, defend us in this day of battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray, and do thou, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the other evil spirits who prowl through the world seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. May the divine assistance remain always with us, and may the souls of the faithful departed, through the mercy of God, rest in peace. Amen. Let us pray for the intentions of the Holy Father. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Saint Padre Pio, Franciscan monk and priest, pray for us. Saint Padre Pio, worthy son of Saint Francis of Assisi, pray for us. Saint Padre Pio, so devoted to the confessional and forgiveness of sins. Pray for us. St. Padre Pio, bearer of the wounds of Christ, pray for us.